Yo, what up guys? So you're playing some CSGO on the 1050 Ti. Now all our system specs will be in the description, but pretty much we're rocking an i5 6600K with 16 gigs of RAM. I know you won't need anywhere near 16 gigs for CSGO. That's just what I have installed on the system. So yeah, just keep in mind that with eight gigs of RAM, that's more than enough for CSGO. So let me go ahead and show you guys the settings right now. We are playing at 1920 times 1080p and everything's maxed out. Later on, we'll go ahead and turn it up to 4K, see how that runs. But it's pretty cool that we're getting a lot of FPS because for anyone rocking like 120 hertz monitors, you could go ahead and play out, I'm pretty sure at a lock one 20 fps telling by how much fps we're getting so so that's cool you'd be able to do that i'm pretty sure as far as the cpu usage like i said we're rocking an i5 it's pretty high man like i i have people telling me that counter strikes a cpu intensive game well i don't i don't know i don't know if you were rocking an i3 if this would affect our fps i'm not sure I, i'm saying it wouldn't like why i don't think an i3 have rocking like an i3 6 100 would affect our fps much but yeah that cpu usage is pretty high so you go go ahead and let me know what you guys think as far as counter strike go cpu related opinions or whatever or facts yeah just let me know Now moving on to our 4K settings, they're pretty much the same for the most part, although we did turn down two things. Our MSAA is now at times two and we disabled motion blur completely, but I know a lot of you guys don't like that anyways, right? Now our goal for 4K was to be able to play at an above 60 FPS all the time, so that's why we went ahead and switched on our MSAA from times eight to times two. It's because when we were playing at a times eight MSAA, we were just experiencing way too many frame drops, it wasn't pretty. But when we turned down our MSAA to times two, it was a lot more stable and maintaining a 60 FPS all the time. Although we did still experience frame drops, but only when aiming down the scope of a gun. My guess would be that when aiming down a scope, the game has to render what's more out in the distance and I guess that resulted in frame drops. It's kind of weird, but it didn't result all the time. Only sometimes when aiming down your scope, it was it was a good grip. It dipped you down into the low 40s. So yeah, that was a bit strange, but another game that does that is Arma 3. I've noticed when zooming in in Arma, it also results in major frame drops. But yeah, besides the issue I just mentioned, maintaining a pretty stable 60 FPS at a 4K resolution was no problem for the 1050 Ti. And yep, that pretty much sums up. If any of you guys want to request any games, feel free. Peace. Counter